Hello viewers, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this particular problem statement, we are going to study the projection of square plane of 100 mm side having its surface or plane inclined at 45 degrees to HP and side in HP. Okay, side in HP. This is the change uh, as compared to the previous problem and the angle rotation the angle is changed. Okay. So repeat the same steps. Okay. Draw one click on snap, draw one reference line xy okay zoom it give the command d text okay here select on the screen 0.2 height and rotation angle is 0 okay so this is my x and y uh, reference plane this is my vp in vp always i draw front view this is my hp in hp i draw top view right and then Press escape okay so my true shape will be uh, in xy uh, sorry below xy that is in hp because side in hp is given and surface inclined 45 degrees to hp is given so i am going to draw one polygon uh, right of having four sides okay and here i am going to select the below button on the keyboard and the uh, line so 100 mm i am going, I'm going to draw it right so this is basically so one autocad unit that is 100 mm polygon that is a square plane okay then press escape give the dimensions okay click on a line okay, select this particular point this particular point you can select this is one autocad unit that is red mm okay now give the naming so do dtx command okay uh, select any point on the screen then do point two angle is 0 so you can select either 0.2 or 0.1 depending upon the complex section right this is a b this particular point is uh, c and this particular point is d and this is basically my two shape okay then press escape button okay so from this particular point a b and c d i'm going to draw uh, the vertical projectors okay so i have selected like this so from this particular point i'm going to draw vertical projector one from this point d i'm going to draw another projector okay so immediately convert this projection line into cyan color right so as i am going to know right so my side in hp means my true length will be on x y okay so i'm going to select the points on x y that is the intersection of vertical projector and xy line right and this is basically my true length so i am going to give the command the text uh, here i am selecting okay a point 2 and rotation angle is 0 right so this is my point a dash b dash this is my point c dash d dash okay and this is my basically true length so I am going to give the dimensions to this true length. You select a line, select this particular point, this particular point, and then this is red and then. Now the true length inclination is given. How much uh, surface plane inclined 45 degrees? So 45 degree inclination is given. Okay. So what I am going to do? I am going to select any point on this uh, x y reference line. Why? Because my true length is on xy okay so I, am, I have selected this particular point that is my a dash and uh, b dash okay so from this particular or what you can do you can uh, so i am selecting point here okay and press escape so i am deleting this particular point okay so because the naming should be perfectly same right so this is my a dash b dash so from this particular point I'm clicking, I'm clicking on ortho from this particular point i'm going to draw one autocad unit line which is basically uh, inclined 45 degrees okay so i have played that so this is my uh, line of true length which is 100 mm okay so this is my particular point okay another point that is c dash d dash so immediately i'm going to uh, give the dimensions of linear dimensions i'm going to select this particular point this particular point is 100 mm. Then going to dimensions, I'm going to select the angular dimensions. So this line I'm selecting, this line I'm selecting, this is 
physically 45 degrees. So immediately I am converting this particular dimension into CR uh, color, right? So now you can also give the naming the text, okay? So if you are giving naming parallelly, so you are basically doubts will be clear, okay? And you can able to locate all the points easily. So this is my A dash, B dash. This particular point is my C dash, D dash, okay? And now from this particular points, I need to draw vertical projectors, okay? So this is my one projector. This is my second projector. So it's not uh, perpendicular. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to select on auto. Now you can check this is the vertical projectors from this particular line point I am going to draw horizontal projector from this particular point again I am going to draw horizontal projector okay so immediately convert this projector line into CR cut so now you got four intersections points so immediately give the four intersections point here this is my one point this is my second point this is my third point and this is my fourth point right so uh, now I need to join this particular uh, four points by a line okay so this is basically my top view dear student so immediately I will give the naming the text uh, specific points I am selecting on the screen point to height and rotation angle is 0 so this is my basically A1 <coughs> this is my B1 this point is my C1 and this particular point is my D1 okay and this is basically my top view okay so here I am right top and this is basically uh, the solution this is my true length right true length definition okay so you can see this is the solution for this particular type of problem statement and here you need to stop right? so please make sure that all the position lines all the dimensions are converted into cyan color and the two length two shape two length relation and top will be in white color okay so i hope you like this particular video if you like this video please like share and subscribe